Hello and congratulations on getting access to this video course on the blueprint to setting up smart one-time offers. So this is video number one, which is the introduction and quick overview. So when it comes to selling your products and services online, you need to ensure that your whole funnel converts. Everything from your lead magnet to your freebie, whatever you're using to build your list, to your front end offer and then to your one-time offer. So in other words, everything needs to be consistent and congruent. If it is not, then your funnel will not convert. But you'll get a better idea as I actually go through and show you step by step. Now, before we begin, we need to check your mindset. And then of course, after that, I'll give you a quick overview of the video course itself so you know exactly what to expect. All right, so let's talk about mindset. So most likely if you're watching this, you are open, but I wanna make sure that you remove any type of perceived notions or thoughts or assumptions that could potentially block you from actually achieving your goal. What I've noticed over time and time again is oftentimes it's not the strategy, but it's actually the mindset that is blocking it. And it's not just the, oh, I can't do this. It's other things that are actually coming into your mind that you don't even know that are, or are, are aware of that are blocking you. So I've seen too many times either product business owners or service-based business owners or any type of business owners, they often, not all, but some of them, a minority tends to say, I hate one-time offers. Anytime you think I hate one-time offers or I hate funnels or I hate this and that, those things can actually block you from achieving what you wanna achieve. You know, so I want to make sure that you throw that out the door so you can focus on the video course. And at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter what we like. What matters is what our customers want. All right. So it's easier for me to say, put yourself in other people's shoes. But in reality, it's actually very hard to do unless you really remove those things out of your mind. And then it makes it easier. And then I'll give you some formulas that you can actually implement that will help you achieve that. Then on the flip side, you've got your customers. Now, if your customers are saying, I hate one-time offers, then that's a different thing. That's something that is clearly wrong with your sales funnel. Now, if one or people, two or people saying that, that's usually okay. But if you got three, four or five, Typically, the rule of thumb is if one person is saying that, then a hundred other people are just not saying it at all. They're just walking away annoyed. All right. So that is a good place to be because that will allow you to say, okay, what is wrong? What can I fix this? All right. So that's what we're going to do today. So now that we have covered that, let's talk about the video course itself and give you a quick overview of the course. So video number one is, of course, this particular video. Video number two is why you must have one time offers, which will be a basic video, but we'll set the tone for everything else. Video number three will be why most one time offers aren't converting. Video number four will be an overview of the smart one time offer and why they convert. So you have a better idea about how they convert and the fundamentals basically. And then of course, video number five, we're gonna dive into actually practical application. We'll take what you learned in the previous video and then apply that in video number five. So in video number five, we'll talk about how to create a funnel with smart one-time offers. So I'll actually get a lucid chart or a mind mapping software and break things down so you can visually see it. Video number six, we'll talk about Different examples will give you smart one-time offer, real example, and we'll relate it to products. And then in video number seven, we'll do something similar, but relate it to services. So if you have a product, you should have a better idea. If you have a service, you have a better idea there. And of course, last but not least, video number eight, we'll talk about different platforms, shopping cart systems that will actually help you achieve this. So we'll help you actually build out the one-time offers. So now that you have a better idea of that, here's what you need. You need a product or service. You need an open mind. You need the willingness to take action and you need a mind map software like lucidchart.com is what I'm going to be using. And I love that software or you can use a free mind mapping software. You can even use a paper and a pen if that suits you. Whatever helps you absorb this information better use that because different people are different. We got visual learners, we got auditory learners, and we have kinesthetic learners. So whatever works best for you is, 
is best. All right. So now that we've covered that, let's move on to video number two.